you are a London designer and you've specifically looked at the things you see around London. You know, for me, things like Pebble Dash or cracked paving stones or, or you know, different types of brickwork and crazy paving are the kind of constituents of, of London, you know, railway tracks. Mm -hmm. So it's a kind of cartoon version of Pebble Dash going on here. Mm -hmm. A cartoon version of brick. So, you know, what's kind of nice is, is when you have these very simple modules that then build up a much more complex image. So this is really inspired, okay, by railway tracks, but also by uh, scale electrics. You've got this infinite number of patterns you can make just with these two modules. There's this kind of isometric brick pattern, which you can either do a conventional brick pattern and keep it all linear, or you can start making much more geometric by, by just turning it one quarter turn every time and make much more complex patterns that then remind you of not London at all, but maybe Islamic patterns or uh, quite complex geometrics. So tiling is great. You know, tiling is, is, is an amazing science. As a designer, how do you feel about, bearing in mind you've got your parameters of your colours and your, your, your geometry and your sizes, other people taking it forward and creating another image from your image? You know, the idea of, of, of inventing the, the thing that other people then use and, and transform, I think, would be fantastic. That's the, the challenge mm -hmm. um, when you visit Bizatza is how on earth you do one thing which um, stands out in, in the kind of forest of extraordinary pattern making.